Welcome to Soccer in the South with Wolfman Jeff coming at you. It's a huge weekend. Friday, Wolves are hosting league leaders Liverpool at the Molyneux. There's a good sized group of Liverpool supporters that meet up uh, at the Feed Company Table and Tavern. That's a place in downtown Chattanooga. So I'm going to be going there tomorrow, and that's going to be 3 o'clock for myself in Eastern Time in Chattanooga. I'm going to hopefully bring the, the phone and get some footage, maybe try to talk to a couple of Liverpool supporters. If there's any Wolves supporters in the area, please come see me, meet with me. 3 o'clock tomorrow, that's Friday, at Feed Company Table and Tavern. Should be a good time. This is probably going to be one of the biggest challenges of the year so far because Liverpool is the only undefeated side in the Premier League and they're just ahead of Man City in the table. Now we're at number seven uh, just under uh, Manchester United but there's only four points between us and 13 which is Brighton. We've had some unfortunate team news that uh, Diago Jota will not be playing. So the question with Jada out, who will Nuno start up front? Now, I think Gibbs White and Jimenez will be there up front. Who's going with him? I think the most likely candidate is Costa. Helder Costa has been there for several matches and he started on several. And his play has improved as of late, but I don't think Costa is quite as solid as he was last year and I'd like to see him ramp it up a little bit, uh, but I could see him starting. Another possibility is Cav uh, could come and start. I think he's been a little uneven since his return. Some are calling for Traore to start. Now, he has a lot of athleticism, and I think he's better coming in from the second half rather than starting. So I hope he plays Traore. We didn't even see him play the other day. He's amazing on the pitch, but not quite sure I want to see him as starter. I am expecting a good match. I'm not sure on the score. I'm being a little conservative and I'm expecting a draw. I'm calling a 0-0 draw, a nil-nil. It could be 1-1. Now, I would absolutely love if our Wolves came and got three points from Liverpool. And that would be amazing because we've done very well against top sides this year. In Liverpool, Eventually, they're going to lose, so why not the Wolves? I'm not holding my breath for it. I would absolutely love that that happened. It's also just as possible we won't get any points and we'll lose to Liverpool. They've been known to do that against other sides this year, so I do expect the Wolves to play well. No matter what happens, it will be a really solid match, and both sides will bring everything to the table. So it should be amazing. So let me ask you. What are your thoughts on this pairing? What are your thoughts about Liverpool and how they stack up against Wolves? Um, who is Nuno going to be putting in his starting side? Um, the Wolves have done really well, as we said, against top sides. So what do you think our chances are? What's your score predictions? So we've done good against uh, the top six, so let's see how we do against the top one. Hit the like button if you like this video. Feel free to subscribe so you can keep up with our content. This has been Soccer in the South with Wolfman Jeff.